So this is the uh, this is my C64X um, now running uh, Ubuntu 11.04. Um, as you can see, we've got uh, we've got Firefox up here now. We've got uh, wireless uh, Bluetooth, and uh, yeah, this is running on a 32-inch uh, HD monitor um, <coughs> with the uh, HDMI connection. So, uh, yep, it's looking good. I mean, the installation was uh, quite went through quite smooth. It's only the near the end of it that the uh, there was an issue with the Broadcom drivers, but uh, that uh, was easily solved by uh, going through Synapsis and um, just changing the just reinstalling some of the uh, the packages. So yeah, this is a. Uh, uh, running it as it is. Um, the power button for the C64X um, you just literally just press it and it just switches on. Um, if I press it now again you'll find that uh, it brings up the uh, shutdown, restart and suspend options. Um, it's quite handy. Um, yeah, And if you hold it down uh, for more than three seconds it'll turn the power, it'll power the machine off. So for like you know, it it'll just work like any other standard power button. Um, the only niggle I said with the machine is the um, the lack of the uh, I found with it a lack of the eject button on the the Blu-ray drive. Um, I didn't realize this was going to be a a software eject uh, drive. Uh, it would have been nice to have the 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 button actually work. Um, but uh, other than that, I said this is you know this is a good machine. Um, so yeah, I'll be installing Windows in it soon and I'll let you guys know.